Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, I finally feel better. It's taken a while. It's taken quite a while. Um, I went to the doctor. Gosh, I don't even know how long I've been sick. <laughs> but um, I think I made my last video like 10 days ago. So I think I went to the doctor that next day or the day after that. Um, but anyway, he checked me for the flu, which I knew I didn't have the flu and I had already passed whatever, you know, as far as being contagious and as far as even being able to, you know, tell what it was at that point. So, um, I, he tested me for flu and he tested me for COVID and I didn't have either one. So he said that he does believe that I had COVID and not the flu, but, um, he said, you know, he's been my doctor for like 25 years or something like that. But he just said, um, I asked him, I said, well, do you think I need to get the flu vaccination? And he said, yes, absolutely. So, I mean, I can't get it right now. So I have to wait for a little while. Um, but anyway, it's just taken, it was rough. It's taken a long time to even feel like myself. And even then it's just, the energy level, my energy level is just not what it, I want it to be or what I would hope it would be. Um, I have gotten out of the house a few times. Levi, you want out? He wants out and then he wants in. Hold on a minute. Emma? But, like I said, my energy level just has not been what... I want it to be. I'm taking vitamins and stuff. But um, anyway, I truly, really think it was COVID because my taste buds were just gone. I mean, things that I loved, I couldn't drink or eat. And um, so I would even bought some donuts from Winn-Dixie and they tasted like dirty feet. <laughs> and I love donuts. You know, they were the glazed donuts. But anyway, it's okay. It is what it is. But um, I do feel better now. I'm just trying to do everything I can to uh, not get it again, whatever it was I had. Um, you know, sanitize my hands a lot more, wear my mask where I know there's a lot of people, um, just doing my best because I really don't think that I could have lived through that again. I mean, I really just don't think I could. And Susan's doing better. Um, she's doing fairly well um so anyway but there's that so i just wanted to come on here and you know let you guys know that uh i was feeling better because i hadn't talked to y'all i've been meaning to do like a community post but just haven't done it and um so i just didn't want to leave you guys hanging for you know the ones that care about me didn't want to leave you hanging for a long time um Levi has a haircut appointment tomorrow. He's a hot mess. He hasn't had his haircut in months because he was sick and then we've been sick. And so he just hasn't gotten his haircut. And so he has an appointment for tomorrow. It was supposed to have been today, but they changed it until tomorrow. So, which is fine. Um, so, they're the ones that come here because Levi freaks out if he goes to the vet in any form or fashion. Or if he's putting a crate to be, you know wind up for his turn and he just panics and stuff so anyway there's that but i wanted to show you guys it is coming close to valentine's day as you can see i do have on this shirt that i got from um <laughs> when i went shopping when i was sick from shein and i'm trying to i didn't put on a bra so i'm trying to use these cup things that and they're not won't stick but anyway it's fine i just need cleaning um, but anyway, I like this sweater. I really do. It's the first time I've had it on, but I thought it would be appropriate to wear this, um, during this video, but because for Valentine's Day, I received this, uh, box from Julia and I told him I would love to do a video on it. I want to say I've done a video for them before. It was on just a ring, I think. And it's been, it's been quite a while. It's been, you know, a few years. But um, I remember loving the ring then. I lost that ring in the move. And I was so upset that I lost it. But um, anyway, 
And so you don't, you know, I, I don't have, um, you know, a, a significant other to spend Valentine's Day with. So I said, well, you know, in that case, you just show a little bit of love to yourself. So if you don't have a Valentine's significant other um, to share this Valentine's Day with, then treat yourself. So this is what the box looks like. Um, it's a real sturdy box. I'm sure it could be used several, several times. Um, when you open the box up, it looks like this. It's got roses. And they smell so good. They smell like almost soap rose, rose soap. And they smell so good. And I've had them this before. Oh my gosh, that smells good. Before I got sick and this smells just as good as it did when I first received the box. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. But anyway, it looks like this. Um, and then the box in the middle. It um it does come out, but I'm just going to like lift the lid, and there are your jewelry pieces. I do have on one of or the ring now. Let me scoot up a little bit so I can show you guys. Um, I do have on the oh I dropped one of my booby covers, but it's okay. I'm up too far. We can't tell anyway. So that's the ring. It's really pretty. It's really shiny. Right now, I had just had my ring light and it's dark outside, but in the sunlight, it is really gorgeous. I will um, take it off and show you what it looks like. It's very, it's a very heavy duty. And I just told them what size I wore and um, they sent it to me. That's what the size of it looked like. really pretty it really is and so it fits on this finger I would wear it on my right hand because you know the left hand I think would be for engagement rings and this is not you know not what I would be wearing as an engagement ring I'm sure you could wear this as an engagement ring it's really pretty okay and then the next thing you get three pieces in this set and I will have everything linked down below and also, I have a coupon code for 20% off. Um, you have the earrings. I can get out of the pack. It come in, comes in two, two packs just to keep it secure and safe. Um, and this is what the earrings look like. Very shiny. Very pretty. Comes with a back like that. Just your normal back. Aren't they pretty? Just shiny. I put the earrings in. Just to show you guys. I love stud earrings like this and I like hoops. And I, I'm not like all kinds of earrings, but it's so pretty. Yeah. So pretty. And these are heavy duty too. I mean, they don't feel like the stem is going to break or the back is going to break. They have the metal backing. Um, it's just really pretty. And I would love to get, you know, something like this for Valentine's Day, whether it be from myself because you should always love yourself more than you do, you know, anybody else. So, why wouldn't you? And then you also get a necklace. This is very pretty. I'm very excited about this necklace. I do have on a, um, a little necklace that I bought a couple of years ago for myself. And this is a very small gold. I don't even know if you can see it, but it's got the little diamond, the little bitty diamond on the, right there on it. But this one is silver, and uh, it kind of matches the earrings and the ring. It's really pretty. It's got the silver chain, and then that's what the necklace looks like. 
Isn't it pretty? I mean, I just can't get over how nicely this is made. I'm gonna go ahead and put it, it's just got your regular clasp chain on it if I can get it on myself. Sometimes I have a hard time getting necklaces on. Isn't that pretty? That's just really pretty. It hangs in just the right place. It really is pretty. Like I said, you have the earrings, you have the necklace, and then you have the ring. Very pretty. That's so sweet. I would love to get something like this for Valentine's Day, <clears throat> even if I got it for myself. So again, that's what the box comes like oh it smells so good i can see you just laying it out on your dresser or something and just get that smell from it and then keeping your jewelry in there i would take this ring off or the other pieces as well if i was gonna like get them wet i wouldn't take a chance i mean i don't even with my good jewelry i still take it off which really my good jewelry consists of this necklace <laughs> um <coughs> excuse me I don't always take this necklace off um, when I'm showering, but sometimes I feel like I should. But it's just so small till, you know, I don't, I forget about it. But um, yeah, this is what the box looks like. And if you're watching and you have a significant other, I'm sure that they would love to have these pieces. Or if you're single and you don't have a significant other, you can buy these for yourself. Like I said, the ring is shiny. Outside, it's just gorgeous. I wore it. I wore just the ring. I haven't worn the necklace or the earrings because I was afraid I might, you know, lose it or misplace it or something before I'd done this video. But um, the ring is very shiny and it just shines, you know, in the light. It's just really pretty. So anyway, guys, that's what I wanted to show you tonight. Um, yeah. I really do like this necklace. It's very pretty. I might split up the stuff and give um, my daughter-in-law's birthdays on the 4th. So I might give her, you know, either the earrings or the necklace and then give my mom, you know, probably the necklace. And since this ring is size to fit me, because I have a very small this is a size five and a half, I think. I have a very small finger, so it probably won't fit anybody but me. But I'll probably keep the ring and then just, you know, spread a little bit of love to um, everybody else. But it's really pretty. I also wanted to let y'all know that Susan's doing better, too. Um, it's been a long, hard road for the both of us, but her especially. And... Um, but we did meet at Ulta yesterday, and um, me and my mom went. Susan met us there, and we got, um, what did I get? Retinol for my face, and it was from the Ordinary. It's in my bathroom. I'd show it to you, but it's just, you know, it's from the Ordinary. It's retinol, and then um, hyaluronic acid, and um, squalene, I think is what it is. Um, but just trying to keep up with the skincare. If anybody knows, my mom is really looking for something to, she doesn't really have any wrinkles, which at 83, that's so impressive. She doesn't really have any wrinkles, but she does have like sunspots. She used to be a sun worshiper. And, um, you know, back in the day we didn't, you know, she didn't really even do sunscreen, but now she does, but she just has the dark spots. And she was looking for something to um, lighten up the dark spots on her face. And she did actually find something. I can't, it was by Molecule Company or Molecule Face Company or something like that. But, and it wasn't expensive either. It was probably about seven or eight dollars. And the um, ordinary thing, I got two of the boxes or um, bottles for, I think my total was like 17, 18 dollars. So, um, Anyway, that's what I'm using right now. And then, of course, moisturizer. But um, anyway, I don't think I'd done any skincare when I was dying. <laughs> I really don't. And I say dying. I say that figuratively. I really do because I thought that I was going to just die. I mean, I was <laughs> hoping for it, to be honest with you. 
Um, what else? What else to update? Um, my daughter is doing better. She um, still has to wear the sling on her uh, arm, but she is doing better. They didn't have to do surgery. It's just hard not being able to pick up a two-year-old. You know, your two-year-old baby girl wants you to pick her up, and she can't do that. So, anyway, there's it's almost an end to that. And then, um, yeah, everybody else is fine. I hope you all are doing well. And I'm looking forward to Valentine's Day. If nothing, just show your love to yourself. I mean, do skincare, you know, have your, maybe go get your feet done, you know, buy you some of this jewelry. Who doesn't love sparkles? I mean, who doesn't love sparkles? So anyway, I'm impressed with this. I really am. It feels very sturdy and um, it's just nice pieces. So anyway, my link will be down below. My coupon code will be down below. And like I said, I hope you guys are having a wonderful week. We're almost to Friday. Um, well, hump day anyway, almost to Friday. But all right, guys, um, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next one, which will be soon. It's not gonna be any 10 days again, but be soon. Love you guys.